back to a brand new Bee Swarm Simulator episode, and today we are going to be advancing in the game. And you guys might ask me, Alanons, what do you mean by advancing in the game? I'm talking about we are adding a new item that we need that's in the progression. I went into like those little models that tell you what you're supposed to be getting next. And the next item they said is I have to get the honey comb belt. In today's video, we're going to have to finish some quests. We need to get the enzymes from the blender magenta, and then we need to go get this honeycomb belt. Let's do this thing. I have my friend Haxer Girl OP helping me. She is from the Discord. Remember, if you guys want to help me in any of these videos, you guys want to play in the private server with us, join the Discord. It's in the description. Make sure to join my group as well. Okay, pull up, bro. What you got me doing now, bro? Watch him. 30 ladybugs, bro. 30 ladybugs. Oh, God. Rifa, I need 25 mil from red flowers. So we are at 44 out of 70 mil. I think the play is going to Pepper, right? Pepper it is. Let's do it. So while we get this goo, I need to talk to you guys real quick. I need to know from you guys, right? Realistically, how long do you guys think it's going to take me to really get to like quote unquote end game? Like how many days of gameplay does it take to get to end game from where I'm at right now? Like, is it going to take me a couple months? Is it going to take me a year? Like how long does it take? Like, I know I've been grinding grinding but like i see people like like hacks girl has the diamond mask she's got the goo boots she's got that canister she's been playing for like years and i want to know if you guys know how long it's gonna take me realistically to get to the end game final 100k here and we're gonna finish this bad boy up and return it there we go let's go done riley b and we only get 20 mil honey for that when are you gonna start giving me like a billion honey oh wait Hacks the girl says we got the windy bee a pumpkin you know that that means we about to go beat up that windy bee hey yo windy bee look at you hiding you know what i i actually didn't know this this is gonna sound really stupid i didn't know so i was always like you have to jump up and like knock it out of the freaking wind cloud whatever i ever since i got the vicious bee fighting everything has been so easy i i freaking love it where'd it go is it going up there oh it is at mountaintop come here come here windy bee come here hacks the girl's like i don't want to fight it because i'm gonna do too much damage i'm like listen you can you still need loot is it going to coco if it's going to coco i gonna be so upset please please go to pepper we both just got our vicious attack can we beat her nine seconds uh oh we got it we got it wait is it gonna be, it's not gonna give me the rewards though it gave me oh it gave me the rewards let's go we got it we got it okay now one of my quests i need to get 37 more strawberries from plant and i think i have all of my planters in areas that are red so let's do this i'm gonna let her know i got puffs but let me let me collect these real quick that got me no strawberries so that's not good we gotta put this back down where are the puffs no wait i have puffs i swear i had puffs. oh man if i don't if I, oh we got the quest done we got the quest done i was gonna be so upset Let's go to Dapper. The Samovar, we're at 19, by the way, guys. Hopefully in like an episode or two. I know we get a special item at 25. I don't know what it is. I'm sure someone can tell me in the comments what I get for 25 uses. Tell me why the why I get such better items from him than I do from Riley. Hey, Riley, why are you scamming me? Almost all of my quests, I need to defeat ants. So I am going to quickly destroy as many ants as I can because I have more than 10 passes. We need to do 29 flying ants. We need to do like 62 army ants. I'm doing quick math in my head. We need to do 22 more army ants. And then I think that's all we need for ants. Okay, perfect. Let's do this. Ooh. Wait, I got a supreme ant amulet. I got the supreme ant amulet. Let's go. Listen, as you guys can see in the bottom, I currently only have 1,300 gummies. I've been having to get all this freaking goo for these quests. Right, have a gummy already. I will get a gummy bee eventually. Doesn't matter how long it's going to take me. I will get the gummy bee eventually. And I got a vicious bee in here too. Oh, God. We got vicious bees. We got gummies. We got things left and right. Oh, and we just took it out that quickly. Where would you guys rank the gummy bee in terms of like me needing to get it? Like, do I just sit there and try to grind out all the gummies I can and use my resources for it? That's my biggest question. I won't bore you guys anymore with the ants we're just gonna speed run and you guys will see the super fast motion skipping of me doing all the ant battles all right we have finished that challenge for ant annihilation 2 please don't give me an ant annihilation 3 because 
I'm tired of fighting these ants. Please don't give me another one. No! 500 ants, 150 army ants, 75 mantises, and one king beetle. Ah! I think the time has arrived. The time for me to retire my old Top Shop belt and get the ultimate honeycomb belt. Honeycomb belt, I am coming for you. We're doing this. Open the shop. Honeycomb belt. For this, we need 50 enzymes, 50 glue, 25 oil, and 75 mil. The honeycomb belt is a luxurious faux honeycomb you can wear as a belt to greatly enhance your pollen capacity. Plus 150,000 capacity. Plus 25% capacity. We need that. We need that. Plus 75 convert amount. 100% loot luck. 20% buzzbeat pollen. 50% honey from token. Plus one colorless bee attack. I am now officially a honeycomb belt wearer. Let's see what it looks like. Let's let's see this fashion. Yo, yo, Haxer. How's the look? How's the honeycomb belt look? New belt, new me. I did. I bought the new belt. New belt, new me. So we need for the guards. That's what I'm getting next. I'm getting these guards next. Watch the next episode is it oh i have enough for the crimson guard i don't have enough for the cobalt guard because i need enzyme how many enzymes do i need i also need 200 total stingers i have 139 stingers so i do have a little grinding to go so maybe not the next episode maybe the after we need 14 more enzymes and i can get the guard okay 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 we're gonna do that we're gonna eliminate mondo chick and see you know how much i want to see how much pollen i have over a mondo chick okay we'll see we'll see how fresh let's see this let's see this we got 12 mil capacity at Mondo chick. Oh, baby. I can't wait till we get like the coconut canister. Like the pollen capacity on that thing is nuts. Like I can literally grind for hours. Like, you know, you guys, you guys know the annoying feeling of having to run back and forth to, to your hive and converting. That is the worst. Like there's people out there. I've seen some videos where people don't even have to move. All of their pollen just gets converted. I'm like, yo, how, how does anyone know what hive I need for that? Or like what has the best conversion? Is it red? Is it blue? Like, is it just like over time? Time, your your stuff gets you there i, I don't know I, I that that's something i gotta i gotta find that stuff out man i gotta find out because i, I want to know how to instantly convert everything where all i gotta do is grind with with the with the community mondo chick is slayed mondo chick stood no chance wait mondo chick could, can't she drop a um an egg i'm pretty sure somebody once told me she could drop like a mythic egg i think i think they were lying but does anyone know if that's true someone let me know in the comments can mondo chick actually drop a mythic egg mondo chick give me a mythic egg like you know how much how much easier and like better my life would be if you just gave me a mythic egg she ain't give me none well there you guys have it i officially am a honeycomb belt owner and getting one step closer to the all elusive end game if you guys enjoyed this episode i asked you guys to do me two small favors number one make sure to subscribe and turn on those notifications so you never miss an episode once again thank you to hackster girl so much for helping me on this episode i love you guys i'll see you guys in the next one peace out